We're back. We're here. We made it. We're alive. I'm Drew with Comics Elite. Here with Kyle. Kyle. Not Kevin. Top 10. Hey! Kapow. We're here. Yep. Best part of the week. The best. Yep. Thankfully, we got, like you said, thankfully we got Diamond. Otherwise, yeah, I think, uh, uh, what would have been have Not had, mm -hmm. not top 10. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is what have been, here's some comics. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So here we go. Got my, okay. got my 10. Okay. Got my honorable mentions. Okay. Yep. And so now, uh, so we don't know. Who's got what in our yeah. top 10? So, mm -hmm. yeah, I'm very curious to see what you got. And I'm sure you're quite curious to see what I got. Yeah. Because you had some in your skip. that apparently you yeah. liked. I just, yeah. I still don't understand it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, first off, uh, start with the honorable mentions. Okay. I was the only one to have honorable mentions. I do have one honorable mention. Oh, you got one. Okay. He going to do one. Go do one. He going to do one. First honorable mention I got is Detective 1053. Okay. I have uh, uh, Fantastic Four Forty. Mm -hmm. Okay, why don't you start with that? Yeah, <laughs> I had some fun with this, and it's probably not for the right reasons. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's stupid. It is. It really is dumb. And Reed does come off like a douchebag big time in this, but it's kind of funny. Like, mm -hmm. <laughs> there's one scene in this that I absolutely love, and it's. Johnny's like, oh, hey, since you do everything, are you going to, like, help me not die? I fix it. I can solve everything. Yeah. He's like, you know what? I can solve it in five seconds. Are you, you going to do it? No. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens. That's what happens. Yeah. Are you you going to fix it? Yeah. No. No. I don't have time. <laughs> he's like, I, you're literally the most important thing I need right now. Yeah. Yeah. It, it seems like he says that to everything and everybody. Yes. He's like, you're the most important thing I need right yeah. now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it is such a... Like, like, I can't help you, but I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> right, when you solve it, I could cure you. You're very fine. Yeah, you gonna, you gonna, you gonna do it right now? No. no. <laughs> Johnny, stop talking. Yeah. We don't have a moon. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go shave. shave. Yeah. <laughs> all right, that's not important I got, right now. I gotta prioritize. I gotta shave, all right? Hey, Sue, you're the most important yes. thing in my life right now. <laughs> <laughs> the most important thing I need. <laughs> and then she looks like, hey, I know what's going on. You're the most important thing I need right now. Come back to the Baxter building. Yeah. <laughs> and then he talks to Silver Surfer. You're the most important thing. Yeah. I yeah. <laughs> it's so stupid. But I love it. I don't know why I get a kick out of Reed being a dick. <laughs> so I, it's an honorable mention. I don't know. It's a weird week. Okay. Yeah, so honorable Batman. Mention, yeah, Batman. Just as fun, right? Detective 1053. Yeah. It, 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 things go from bad to worse. You know, we're seeing some escalation happen now. From better to worse. Yeah, which is great. Solid art, even though it's not Ivan Reese. Yeah, you yeah. know, it's an honorable mention. Yeah, it's okay. good. Very good. Okay. Forgot to read it. Okay. Uh, next honorable mention I got is Monster Kill Squad number four. Final oh, issue. Okay. One of the last comics. Yeah, um, it got bumped out. Got bumped. And it got bumped. Okay. Yeah. Just like a career day. It gets bumped. It gets bumped. Yeah. It's true. It happens. And this was, this is another one. This was fun. It's a fun wrap-up issue. I had fun reading it. I, I could tell. What they were doing, like, they're laughing at her because, like, she didn't realize she was the villain through her monologue and diatribe. It would have been funnier if they just walked away. Yeah. Hey, I, I'm, I'm talking right now. Yeah. Like, that's, like, the those, those scenes in the movie, um, was it a dirty work? When uh, the guard, guard said, like, <laughs> yeah. I've, I found a piece of me now. I found reason. Yeah. I found meaning. Wait, wait, wait. Where, where'd you guys go? <laughs> oh, guys? <laughs> just, if she was just monologuing and she's like, wait, where'd you guys go? Yeah. What? Where's everybody? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Everyone running around with me is dead. Yeah. Okay. That would have been funny. Yeah. But, um, yeah, it's a fun wrap-up issue. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And my last honorable mention is Superior 4, number two. Oh, my God. This was so much fun. Uh, naturally, when you get four Doc Ox together, they don't play well together. It happens. Sure. You know? Uh, then when you toss in a Doctor Doom version of Doc Ock. The oh, only fun part about this. Things get even more interesting. And not I loved it. It's too childish. It's a point. It's a comic book, Kyle. No, Jesus, you, you can't use it as an excuse yes, when you, you want to. You yes, toss you that out as I want a serious story, but it's a comic book. No, they're having okay, fun. I want to no, have fun, just, but it's a comic book. Yeah, it's you like, can have, I had fun reading this. I had a lot of fun reading this. Too childish. It's fun. It was, it was. It was fun, and despite getting his ass handed to him, Doc Ock still feels like he's going to prevail. I love it. He's talking at the end. He's like, "Oh, Jesse's like, just wait." I'm going to get of out. Of course he will, it. because it's, it's a great. joke. It's great. I love it. it great. My There's no fun. stakes. It's just a straight-up fun comic. It's just straight-up fun. Superior 4, number 2. 
Straight up fun. It is a number two. <laughs> You're an upper decker. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I'll take it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Top ten of the week. Top ten. Top ten. Number ten. Number ten. I've got Oriason, number one. Okay. I have Primordial. That would have been an honorable mention for me. Okay. Uh, so some, some of these, we only got one issue. Yes, we can only get one issue because Ernie uh, wouldn't Ernie, allow us. Yep, Ernie would not allow us. Uh, he only he only ordered so many. Yep. Said, "No, you're taking one." It's like, okay. Uh, but Sean's here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you only take one. Okay. Yep. So yeah, that would have been an honorable mention for me. Mm -hmm. uh, but so yeah, so Primordial is it's a wrap up. Mentioned? It's a wrap up. Yeah. It's the end. Didn't make a whole lot of sense. Not really. <laughs> it's is it fucking weird? Yeah. Is it Jeff Lemire? Yeah. When he's great, he's great. When he gets weird, he gets weird. And it was it was heartfelt at the end. Like you, you kind of felt it, but I had no fucking clue what was going on. It was like, it, it, okay, it ends. It just yeah. it, it just ends. It, I want to know more about the world and what what's going on. And yeah, that's not the point of the story. Yeah, and I guess not the point of the story. But when you set up this alternate universe yeah. where the Soviet Union is effectively. Taken over, Take, which we're led to believe. We guess. Yeah. I want to know more about that. Yeah. Nah, you get a dog that mm -hmm. talks. It's like, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's adorable. It's a dog. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Oriason. Oriason, number I one. Think. Yeah. Uh, this was a fun oh, monster yeah. story. This was a well-illustrated, mm -hmm. well-paced, right amount of dialogue. Yes. Just very terrific suspense thriller. Yes. And... Had me on the edge of it. I'm just like, when that happens next. And oh yeah, I there's a few of these that we got in this week, and mm -hmm. I read them so fast yeah. because they're so kinetic and fast paced. Yeah, that one was like, Ooh. yeah. Well, at first, when I when I turned the page, there was so much left. It's like to be continued. I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, it's but, like, then, but then immediately, it's like, <laughs> it's like, it's like yeah, two weeks later. Yeah, whatever, it's, it's like it's okay. Like, I was like, god yeah. damn it. I'm like, if you were gonna yeah. really end that like that, yeah. Jesus, I was pissed. Yeah. yeah. But then it ends again. I'm like, dang yeah. it again. Yeah. But it's so fun. Terrific horror story. Terrific monster story. Yeah. Cannot recommend yeah. it enough. Yeah. Absolutely fun read. If you can find the second site books, get them. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They're going to be hot. Yes. All right. Okay. Number 10. Number nine. Okay. I got Primordial. I have Number six. Silence. Silence. Number one. <laughs> Language. <laughs> yeah. All right. Tell him, Dimitri. <laughs> Silence. Silence. Um, yeah, this um, it didn't quite go as what I thought it was going to go. <laughs> like, like, okay, where is he going with this? Mm -hmm. Same writer. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so dance lot. Yep. <laughs> Theoretically. Yep. <laughs> we talked about it before. I, I had a lot of fun with it. Yeah. And just what the hell happens? It's just like, uh, oh, oh, that's where we went. <laughs> And then it kind of it's like oh shit. So is this kind of like a secret window thing going on? We don't know, uh, but I'm definitely intrigued by this. So it's a solid recommend this week. Yep, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. It, it was a it just you no. Know, it probably would have been an honorable mention. You know, it probably mm -hmm. should have been. But yeah, it's really good. Okay, primordial. Like you said, Kyle said, great mm -hmm. wrap up issue. Yeah, it's very emotional. Mm -hmm. It's very heartfelt. Mm -hmm. It was just, it was all about the animals getting home. It's all about the dog just getting home. And yeah, they, and love prevails. Love stops their, stops what? Stops the fighter jets and stops the, <laughs> from what? <laughs> from, from shooting it down, from shooting down the, would they have shot it down? That's what they're trying to do. They but were, it wasn't anything. It was just blocks. Like we yeah, didn't that know was what the, that was, the, that was the alien ship. But was it a ship? Yeah. It's what's what, well, we don't know what would have happened if they had. No, because they couldn't. Because, <laughs> but it was it like, no. My 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 point is like, is it like Independence Day where they have shot it and it just nothing would have happened? Like there would have been a force field. Would it have gone? Is it like a I think time no, dimension no, I, jump? I, I think what they show us. I think everything turned into cubes. I think yeah. And what does that mean? I, I think it's kind of like um, Lawnmower Man. <laughs> the movie Lawnmower Man. Oh, when, okay. Uh, the, like the, the CGI. Yeah, the, oh, like okay. when the cops and the people turn into. 3D cubes and blow away. I think that's what happened to the fire jets. They turn into <laughs> cubes and blow away. But it's a great, it's a great it heartfelt issue. It's, it's a great, it's a great, it's a great heartfelt ending. Yeah. I get it. But yeah, like you said, there's a lot of questions still yes. that aren't answered. Uh, but 
It won't be probably. Yeah, probably that's probably fine. Won't. That's yeah. fine. Not the point of the story. I love Jeff Lemire. He's yeah. probably still a top five writer for mm-hmm. me right now. So yeah. he wrote three of the best stories last year: it's Primordial, great. Robin and Batman, and Maze Book. So yeah, 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 yeah totally. So, there we go. Yep. And number eight. Eight. Eight for the week. The Ocho. The Nom, number three. I have the Flash, oh. seven seventy nine. Le Flash. Le Flash. Le. Le. Uh, I had uh, a lot of fun with Venom. This is a okay. trippy and weird issue. Symbiote is. kings without bodies, but with minds in a symbiote garden. Mm-hmm. There's no escape. Love it. Like you said, it's a key. It is a key. Yep. If you didn't watch our previous video, it is a key. It's a key. A lot of new symbiotes. Um, yeah. One's like a, a dumbass. It's yeah. pretty funny. <laughs> yeah, who's like the end of the world. Like, you gotta yeah. listen to me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's like, uh, what's his name from... Um, Invasion of the Body Snatchers. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, so things get pretty trippy in this in this issue, and oh, yeah. there's some big revelations toward the end. Mm-hmm. Art is solid once again by Brian Hitch. It's great. Yeah. So I'd recommend. Then mm-hmm. I'm number five. Okay. Flash seven seventy nine. The Rumble in the Gym World. Mm. This was fun. Absolutely. This was great. Yep. Um, we it's basically a wrap up of this gym world and what happens and. Uh, Wally and the kids, what's kind of going on with the kids, I thought had a good ending to it. Mm -hmm. Um, One of the characters we thought was just a rando, what turned out to not be Mm -hmm. so rando, and uh, actually was legit. And I was like, oh, okay, that's a fun little Mm -hmm. little tease. Mm -hmm. I like that. Um, I I liked how it it wrapped up. I I, I liked it it ended how it needed to, and Mm -hmm. it it stuck the landing, I thought. Art's still good. Mm-hmm. Art is solid. Yeah, and it's Love one it. of those to where, like, the one artist will do, like, the first three pages, mm-hmm. and then it'll switch, and you really don't notice it. Yeah, thankfully. Yeah. <laughs> Which I always appreciate. Yeah. It doesn't go from good to absolute dog shit. So I I appreciated that. So, yeah, I thought it wrapped everything up really well. Yeah. And this was a solid recommend this week. I'll talk about that one yeah. later. All right, number seven. Seven. The Sieta. Yes. I've got G.I. Joe number one. I have Defective Comics 1053. Okay, why don't you continue with what I had to say about Detective? Yeah, I thought this this was teetering on the, the meh 10. Um, I haven't enjoyed the past couple issues like like you have. I felt once the veil was lifted, it, it kind of lost its mystique, and it just kind of lost that kind of fun to it once you kind of found out what was going on. But... The one thing that gripes me in this, it's like, okay, they they know everything's fucked. Mm-hmm. They know the whole thing is a facade, and it's like, <laughs> <laughs> and you're not an idiot now. Yeah, <laughs> and they don't do anything. Like they're sitting in the back cave, and they're like, "Hey, this guy's probably bad, and everything you're doing mm-hmm. is wrong, but we're not going to do anything." No, <laughs> it, that, that just seemed kind of. It's like. Nightwing's in there by himself, still mm-hmm. undercover for yeah. reasons. Deep cover. It's like he's. It's like okay, this is obviously bad. Like this is mm-hmm. obviously wrong, and everyone knows it's wrong. But we're just going to continue to slink around this place. It's like no, you bust in and you stop it. Like well, it's for. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't. We don't even know. Like, is an issue a day? Is an issue two days? We don't know the we don't the, know. the progression. It's this could all be. This could have been all been two days, the last three or four issues. Yeah, because the last issue they had a timer. Yeah. So there was a theoretical th- like ticking clock. clock. Yeah. And then they get rid of that in this. Then it's just people doing stuff. Mm-hmm. And, and I'm like, but you guys already know it's bad. And why aren't you going after this Dr. Weird guy and like beating the shit out of him and being like, what's going on? Tell me what you know, mm-hmm. sort of thing. And they're like, nah. <laughs> we're, not, not important. we're just, we're just going to keep like, Building an investigation for what? You're not cops. You're not yeah. going to yeah, the You court. have to let Veer deep dig himself further. Doesn't matter how many bodies <laughs> are in the way. Doesn't matter if people die. Just got to let him. Yeah, just let him bury him, himself. Let him yep. keep going to the penguin and saying, I need a loan. Yep. And it's like, oh. Come, just let him keep acting like Gil from Simpsons. Come on. Help out old Gil. I know. It's like, what are you doing to this guy? Like, the yeah. fact that you know he's evil and you're going to continue to let him. <laughs> Run up debt and eventually probably get shot and left in a dumpster yeah. somewhere. <laughs> You're an enabler. <laughs> yeah. It just seems kind of, kind of, kind of mean. Yeah. So, why is it in my top ten? 
because <laughs> I still had fun with it, and it's still good. It's still solid. So yeah, it's solid recommended right. this week. So yeah, it was good. GI Blow. I got GI Joe. This is no, okay. Full title. Okay. Saturday Morning Adventures. GI Joe, that's, a real American hero. You need to read that. Number one. If you don't read that top title, <laughs> yes. You're, you will be lost if you don't read that. Remember that. Saturday morning cartoons, G.I. Joe. And you will be like, what the fuck? All I got to say is I had so much fun reading this. So well illustrated. It's perfect. It is, it is legit the 1980s action cartoon. It is. In comic book form. Everything straight down to the very last page. The the God, I love it. The public the, the, the public safety. Yeah, the PSA. The, the PSA at the very end, but it's about um don't be don't be an online <laughs> choice. Yeah, don't be nasty online. Yeah. It is great. I I, so I think when good. we're done here, I'm gonna put it on the community page. I gotta put post that yes. page in the community page. I'm like, this is gold right here. This is Everybody awesome. Everybody needs to read this right yes, now. Yes, it is awesome. This issue is just fun. It it's right there on the cover. <laughs> cover commander gets a the genie is a it's the Aladdin a, lamp. A, a lamp, lamp and which is for a giant <laughs> co a cobra pot. <laughs> it's so perfect because it's so stupid. <laughs> and then the next one, like they need to get a, make it make the stronger around his weakness. You need to make it, it's, sure, he's like, okay. you want to make it stronger, don't you? I yeah. can make that happen. Yeah. <laughs> it is great. I it love is, it. Yeah. The next issue is going to be even better because they're breaking up the strike teams, going to different cities. Yep. We're going to get more of the Joes involved. Um, oh, I, I can't wait for the next issue. This is, I we got two wishes left. Yes, yeah, so, only oh, two, it, which is a shame. I know. It, like I said, this is just so much fun. Saturday morning adventures, GI Joe, a real American hero, number one. You, yes, if you're our age or older, you will enjoy this. I oh yeah, it. yeah. I mean, it's like a vitamin B12 shot. It's yeah. Got, like nowadays, like you're reading some of this dog shit. It's like like this Iron Fist. Yeah, it's yeah. one of the last things that we read, and I'm like. <laughs> Thank God. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Needed this. Absolutely. Yeah. If you do pick it up, save it for last. Yes. You will enjoy yes. it. Yes. Uh, number seven. Six. Six. Already? Yep. Six okay. of the week. Okay. Thor. Oh, shit. Hey. Thor. Thor 22. I figured that would have been higher. Uh, another one. It's a key. It's a key. Yep. It's a key. Um, yeah. First full Odin Force Thor. Yeah, is that what it was called? Yeah, because yeah, because he had the Odin Sun Spirit. Yep, but uh, yep, there's okay. a there's a big death in this. Oh yeah, not gonna say who. Well, we assume. Yep, huge ram huge ramifications in this. Oh yeah, it, action packed. Yeah, things won't be the same after this. I hope not. The only problem I have, I want a more better rebuild. I know better rebuild is like in the, there in the first page if you're and like, and then the splash page. page? Yeah, it's like you get them. He's doing the, uh, you know, Avengers Assemble. Simple. With, like, with the other Avengers, yeah. Yeah, like, we need everybody here. This is the yeah. biggest thing in the fucking world. I need everybody. And you get Throg. You get everybody yep. showing up. And the, Captain it, America, Doctor Strange. Yeah. Them, yeah. I'm like, holy shit, this is going to be a fucking battle. Yeah. And it's... I don't want to spoil it. No. But... It's like... Yeah. Oh. Okay. Okay. Maybe it'll be yeah. the next issue. Yeah, hopefully, um, yeah. You don't get... You don't bring up Better Ray Bill and not use Better Ray Bill. That's just... Yeah. Yeah. So... Yeah, I thought it was action packed. It, it was it was fun. I, I know I it was a meh the last time I think I mm -hmm. did it, which yeah. was sacrilege. Yes, like, it was. Whatever. Yeah. Um, but this one, yeah, I, this is a lot of fun for me. When Donny Cates, when he's on it, he's on it. Yep. So, and I have hope that he will stick the landing because mm -hmm. this is issue four or five, right? We got the last con it concludes in the next one. I think so. One or two more. Yeah. It's yeah. Okay. So I think actually, yeah, I think next one is yeah. the conclusion. Yep, this is part four or five. Yep, for the God of Hammer. So yeah, one more. So yep, it's all I recommend this week. Yep, absolutely. Art's still great. Nick Klein, yes, yes. he's killing it. Uh, number five of the week, right there in the middle. Yep. Flash seven seventy nine. I have Hulk number four. Oh, the bulk. The Incredible Bulk. It's that low. Yes. Wow. That low. Or that high. <laughs> Depends on how you look at it. So uh, Flash seven seventy nine. Yeah. Damn good. What? This was damn good. I love this so much. Mm -hmm. Final fight with Eclipso. Will Wally survive? I hope. Will his son be cured? I fucking hope so. I'm not going to say. It's tough seeing that kid yep. wince in pain and yes. basically kill himself. himself yeah. <laughs> Just know the art is good. Yes, it is. My only complaint is on one page. 
The money shot panel is not present. Mm. I was let down. I'm going to show you the page. This is the page I was let down with. You do not do this. This is a dreadful sin. I know. Yes. It was the money shot wrong page. Wrong angle. Wrong angle. Yes. Yeah. I it should have. You could have done it like a like a close up panel right down here. Yeah. Of it. Yeah. You guys will know the panel I'm talking about. Like page. Flip yeah. it around. Like you mm -hmm. see it from. You click like the angle. Oh, from, from like his yeah, back of his head. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. That would have been awesome. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that would have been great. Yeah, yeah, then it gets heartfelt at the end and, yeah. when we have a character show up and yeah, explain. A character show up and explain things. Yes. I have not seen him since Tomasi was writing Detective Comics. Wow. And they get he gets into a conversation with the Flash where they actually legit say, Yes, he exists. He's here. Yep. He's here. Get used to it. Yep. It's like, uh oh. Yeah, so he's here. I'm not saying. I'm just saying. Just saying. Yeah. We're not talking. We're just, just talking. talking. So. This is good. Absolutely. Flash 779. You've got to read this. Absolutely. Credible bulk. Number four. Mm -hmm. This. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. I mean, the adrenaline you get from these books. I mean, I, I feel like he just steps on the gas mm -hmm. and just keeps going. Mm -hmm. Like this issue, we get more about the world with President Ross. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah and the lengths he goes to and mm -hmm. we saw the 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 best part of this <laughs> was and i'm pretty sure you would probably agree is seeing that mushroom cloud over xavier's yes. <laughs> he pretty much nuked all the meats yeah <laughs> yeah he did uh, he did he killed he's pretty much so President Ross has pretty much killed everybody. Any any, any human, yeah. human they're they are gone. Everyone's dead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or never heard of. Yeah. Yeah. We, we, <laughs> we do find that out. It's like this banner on this earth is like, who are you talking about? Yeah. And he brings up some people. And then how it ends. Oh, key. Another key. Yep. I don't even know what the fuck this thing is, but yeah. uh, we it, get it's a first. It's we, a key. Get a, we get a first something at the end of this. And it's yeah. like, I didn't I didn't see that. <laughs> I didn't see that happening. What you didn't see that coming? <laughs> no, Quicksilver, I didn't. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I didn't see. So this this was so much fun this week. Mm -hmm. It's all I'd recommend. Absolutely, a lot of fun. All right, next up, top four. Top the, four. The fabulous four. Yes. Amazing Spider-Man eighty nine. What the fuck? That yes. is not that high. Yes, it is. God damn it! I have cloaked. Oh, three or four. Ooh. Okay, so I will They're talk about wild cards. Spider Man 89. Yes. How the hell did this get that high up? Spidey's time? back on track, baby. Yes. Goblin Queen versus Black Cat, and it is not pretty at all. She's got an awesome power. I'm not going to spoil what that power is. You can guess. But let's just say she really she fucks with the Black Cat, and it's good. Kind of needed it. Yes, yeah, she did. And you see, you see <laughs> the, the tears come. It's like. Mm -hmm. Oh, she just, yeah, she fucked her up like Percocet. Mm -hmm. I had so much fun with this issue. Action-packed, well-illustrated, suspenseful, well-paced, and a lurking uncertainty of Peter and his health. Because at the end, when we're led to believe, it's like, oh, yeah, I, I made it out. It's like, I made it out. And it's like, wait, well, oh, you, you didn't. It's like, get better already. <laughs> Peter, be better. Yeah. <laughs> That's all he needs to be told. Uh, this was damn good. Enough said. You will have fun reading this. Amazing Spider-Man is back on track, baby. I like Ben Riley when he just left Mary Jane. <laughs> and I love how Which she brought that up. They, they bring it up. And yeah. It's awesome. Yeah. It's like, he fucking left. <laughs> he ditched me. It's like, good. I can leave you too. But <laughs> yeah, anyway. Cloaked, three of four. I didn't read the first two. No idea what the fuck this is. But I read it. Uh -huh. And holy shit. Like, this, I, I guess he's a Batman. Yeah. There's a Batman character. Yeah. Batman, Batman type, type character. Type character. Yeah. And the. There's a Joker type character mm -hmm. in this that the dete a detective goes to see, <laughs> and this this crazy guy's been locked up for 20 years, <laughs> and he's had electroshock therapy <laughs> pretty much the entire time he's been in this insane asylum. So like Arthur Fleck. Yeah, and they're like he said he knows the identity of this cloaked mask set whatever the hell his name yeah. is, <laughs> um, and. I, I mean, I, I was like, holy shit. And then the Joker character tells you a backstory of this guy and what he saw mm. him do. And it's like, whoa. 
I, I mean, I, I didn't see it coming, and it, it's, it's wild. Well, what was great about like the, the sidekick kid? He's growing up in the issue. He's kind of helping out with the female cop. In the first issue, you discover that uh, he was this other guy. What other guy was a side, his sidekick, but um, he didn't live with him or anything. Like he just he was a kid. You could call him like here, show up at this location. Here's the costume. I'll pick you up here. I'm gonna drop you oh. off afterwards. Like. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah, he became like a, a minor celebrity after that. Oh. Just, yeah, it's, it's a fun. It's, it's a fun, fun yeah. story. I had no idea what was going on, but I was yeah. along for the ride, and I was able to piece it together. And mm -hmm. by the end of this, I was like, I have to see the next. Day. I gotta know what the hell. Gots to know. I gots to know. So this mm -hmm. was a solid recommend this week. Yeah. This was a lot of fun. It's just a surprise because <laughs> I don't know what this is. There, there were a few surprises this week. There were a few. Yeah, there like Amazing Spider Man eighty nine. It is a fantastic Shit. read. Fantastic. Shit. Top three of the week. Yep. Here we go. Okay. Number three of the week. These damn kids, number one. G.I. Blow. Saturday morning adventures, G.I. Joe, Real American. G.I. Joe. Why don't you continue my thoughts on that? Yeah, for four bucks, well worth it. Absolutely. Um, yeah, when Cobra Commander gets Aladdin's lamp yes. and the genie shows up, I, I was just like, I'm all, I, I don't even care what happens <laughs> after this because that is friggin' hilarious. Yes. And it is perfect. The art is perfect. In this. Yeah. And just the genie explaining, like, you know, he can't bring anybody back from the dead and he can't, can't do this, yeah. can't do that. It establishes all the rules. Yep. <laughs> and then he's built a giant robot. Yeah. <laughs> I, well, when you have, you know, Destro, it's like, yeah. Arms manufacturer. Yeah, he should know. He should know. Yeah, yeah, and he does. Yep, and it goes how you think it's gonna go. Yeah, and then the PSA at the end is just, yeah, it's perfect, absolutely perfect. perfect. I was yes. dying laughing, reading it. it. It it is what this needed. Honestly, if this were a cartoon, that would be the PSA at the very yes. end. I guarantee it. It yes. is terrific. It fits. God, this was so much fun this week, especially. It's, this is what was needed. Mm -hmm. All right, now the exact opposite uh, <laughs> of this book. Woo! These <laughs> damn kids. These damn kids. Number one. Like uh, Mr. Wilson. Yep. Uh, this was a Woo. wild, wild, trippy, crazy ride. Oof. Holy crap. Yeah. Whoa. Uh, murdering kids. Going, going from foster home to foster home. I, I, I can't spoil anymore. I, I don't I know. I, I don't want to spoil anything more. It's Just gruesome. know it's gruesome. It's messed up. So yeah, I was picking up, I don't know if you picked this up, the movie Sinister. Mm -mm. With Ethan Hawke. No. I didn't I didn't really make that connection with it. With the uh like Pazuzu character, kind of from Exorcist 2, Pazuzu? Yeah. And how he kind of shows up and kind of like forces the kids to kill the parents, sort of thing. Mm. And all the home movies. Oh, it's it's he's luring kids <laughs> to kill the adults, and I'm just kind of like, it's like that, but equally twisted. Mm -hmm. More, but like <laughs> this, where it differs. Yeah, the religious mm -hmm. the aspect. Angle. Yeah, and the angle of it. I was like. Oh, mm -hmm. and then how it ends? I'm like, oh god! Yeah, I, I, <laughs> Literally. Didn't, I didn't. I didn't. I was trying to understand how that how that ended. I'm like, so are they implying that the one that female character, the adult, isn't in, is involved with this, or are they getting ready to kill her? Yeah, that's what I. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Like the kids are going in that orphanage, it's, so now it's not just like a brother, or yeah. two brothers, or. Mm -hmm. Three kids. It's like it's a whole fucking orphanage, Finish. yeah, <laughs> <laughs> of kids. Like yeah. Village of the Damned, yeah. And we're actually gonna do shit. Woo, yeah. Man. Get the willies to think about this comic. Yeah, it, it is an unsettling comic. It really is. Yes, it, it it was not what I was expecting. Yeah, from that book. I mean, if you got it, you got to pick this up. Absolutely, art is great. It takes place in 1999. Yes, that's a big important, thing. Important in this. plot. So if you see a guy. <laughs> With a pager repeatedly. Yeah. Why does he have a pager? Oh, yeah. In the very first blog, it says 1999. That's why. And for those of you who don't know, look up what a pager there is. is. <laughs> yes. I forgot. Yeah. If you, don't, yeah. if you don't remember, yes. Yep. So that's a big part of this. So, yeah, it 
Oof. Yeah, talk about that. Yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Do I need to put that to the side for you? Yep. Okay. <laughs> All right, number two for the week. I've got <laughs> I got Hulk number four. <laughs> These damn kids. Yeah, it's hey. I, I pass it off to him and you're gonna continue. It's as somebody who is writing wants to write a horror comic like this the, and I'm not saying it's, not, it's almost like a how to but like he <clears throat> this golden guy he writes it so well in the sense that it's it's a lot of show don't tell shows a lot and they're I mean the mm-hmm. Which is great, which is how it should be. Not a lot of dialogue. There's very little dialogue. And that's just, and that's, that's what you were, in my opinion, an experience where it doesn't matter if you have a lot, if you have a little, it's how you tell the story. Yeah. You know, you don't, not every situation calls for Tynan esque, but uh, Bendis esque amounts, amounts of dialogue. You can tell a story with great art and a very small amount of dialogue. I do that in mine. There's going to be, yeah. There's gonna be a certain amount of dialogue. I don't need that much dialogue, and he 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 nails it. Yeah, here. like with my story, I have very minimal dialogue, and it's not basically something like, but like it's it's a horror thing to it, and it's like I'm like this is almost exactly what I'm trying to go for, like and it's perfect. Like he sets up scenes, and it's like let them breathe. It's like it's not it's all this like deconstruction now. Mm-hmm. It's like well, let's deconstruct everything. Let's deconstruct horror. Like what's it mm-hmm. mean? It's like he he hits you with it right away and like he i mean this isn't deconstruction at all it is fucking balls to the wall mm-hmm. gr- i mean gruesome deaths i mean it's it's pretty messed up this was a solid record. this was a, mm-hmm. did not expect this this week no absolutely not this yeah. was awesome if you can find it pick it up and once again like i said ernie he ordered a small amount of these he only told yep. us we could have one yeah the second sight yeah yes. this i don't know how how elusive these are going to be but I'm gonna try to pick one up. Yeah, this guy, yeah, Golden. He's on. His name is on several of these books. Yeah, he, he's he's publisher right. editor of this uh, publishing company. So yeah, good for him. Absolutely. Yeah, these are terrific books, yes. and I can only hope for these books. Issue twos. I know are just as strong. We'll see what happens. We will see what happens. Yep. And okay. so I got for my number two of the week. I got Hulk number four. Okay. Uh, this was awesome. I mm-hmm. love this book. Uh, we're on Earth one twenty two. It's we're on Earth one twenty two. Mm-hmm. Uh, things are very different. Things have not gone the way the normal Marvel Universe has. It's much darker. Oh, yeah. It's Hulk versus President Ross and his armored soldiers. <laughs> Battle does not go Ross's way at all. So Ross has to bring in a secret weapon, <laughs> which is, like it was related to earlier, it's another key. Mm-hmm. It's character. Uh, the next issue doesn't look good for Hulk at all. No. But I do, what I, I think I do love is like to make, when they make Hulk stronger, when you person engage level four, it's like it's different scenarios. The, le- it. the level four scenario, it's like awesome. Love so it. So great. Yeah. No one's well what that is. And how strong he gets at level four. four. Yeah. I'm like, oh man. Yeah. Cranking it, it up. It is this is so fast paced, mm-hmm. action packed, bloody well done. So much smashing and dismemberment in this issue. Ryan Otley. Gotta get across oh, no, Ryan no, no, Otley. No. Ryan Otley's killing it too. That's My great. God. Love it. Hulk number four. Fun. Yes. Yes. Fun. fun. F-U-N. You're allowed to have fun. Yes. Number one of the week. I was tearing. It was almost going to be that. Mm-hmm. But I, I had too much fun with this one. Yep. Vamp verse number five. Oh, of course. Okay. <laughs> That's sitting over there. I didn't read it. Kidding. Animal Castle, number three. Of course. The, this is turning into my indie hit of the year right now. It's mine. I don't know what could beat this right now. No, some. I mean, there's some good horror stuff, but this, the allegories yeah. in this, how I'm like, especially this day and age. Yeah, with you know people younger than us coming up who think this way of thinking. You know, the Bernie Sanders way of life is so great. It's like mm-hmm. read this book. Mm-hmm. This is basically what they want. Read about the Soviet Union. Yeah. And why it doesn't work. Yeah. Why socialism and communism doesn't work. It yep. will never work because of this. Mm-hmm. And this is a interesting, fun, toned down way of being able to yeah, explain I, it. Yeah, You know, you could say it's really a more fun version of Animal Farm. Yeah. It really is. A more fun version of that. And digest it much easier. And fun characters. 
They're great. They're great. They're so well illustrated. They all have character in here. Yeah. Like uh, Caesar, the rat. I. Yeah, the Caesar rat, yeah, is the he is my Caesar is my favorite character in this. He is the the love machine rabbit. Mm -hmm. All the ladies love him, love him. Right. And he's he's that he's that degenerate with a heart of gold. You know, he's taking yeah. care of the, the kittens at night. You know, and yeah. uh, um, yeah. and I one thing one thing I said there was an emotional panel here too, where how they set up for um because they're, they're what they're doing the, the dogs are in control of this town, and these people they want their freedom and they know they can't fight the dogs on a physical level. So they're fighting them on other levels. One of them is humor. Yep. And which the dogs don't understand. And they don't like it. They don't, yeah, they don't yeah. like it. Yeah. <laughs> and it's great. And there's one, there's one moment where they've set they've erected this little statue thing, a pinata thing, and the donkey yeah. tries to hit it. He can't, he can't he, hit he, it. He gets scared. You 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 see the yeah. sadness on his face. The the emotion the, what's the artist's name? Felix Delop. Yeah. Oh, he draws the emotions so damn well in this. You almost get choked up reading it. Mm -hmm. It is fantastic. And you, you really feel sorry for these animals and you really do hope that they get their freedom. Yeah. In a yeah. way, and and how they go go about it with the daisy. Yes, I, uh, yeah, the, the escalation oh. of the daisy, because it's a callback to the first issue yep. with what happened to uh it was the uh was it the goose. The goose. The goose, what happened to the goose? Name was Daisy. Daisy, yep. What happened at the end of that was mm -hmm. yeah, chilling. Yes. Yeah, and then so as a way of getting back, it's like with humor, it's like, well, we're going to go after mm -hmm. the bull mm -hmm. this way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and just how you're able to reduce this giant bull who's like, <laughs> I got nothing. If you guys want to take me on, yep. bring, it, bring it. Yeah. <laughs> bring it. There's nobody here. It's just me. Yeah. And they reduce him to a fucking joke. joke. <laughs> literally. And it is hilarious. You just tell, yeah. stop laughing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, I love it. It's so great. It is like I'm just why people aren't reading. It's like you have to read this. Now I will say, you know, I I, I can't say it's a perfect comic. Uh, I can't say it's perfect because on an art level. Reason why is because I mean it's a European comic. I know. And for that reason, it's because the pages are shrunk down. Yeah. The borders are Awful. massive. Yeah. The, yeah. The, yeah. It's you yeah. Get this thick of border. It's like yeah. It was so when Blow you're when you're shrinking down those pages, yeah, and you have dialogue bubbles. I mean, tiny. Yeah, they're they are very tiny. There's a lot of dialogue mm -hmm. and very small bubbles. So you better have your reading glasses on. Yep. Um, that's my one problem with this. My biggest gripe. Yeah. I said it from the beginning. I'm like, yep. I just can't. See, and this art is so good. Absolutely. Yeah. This needs to be blown up. Yeah. <laughs> like I need to see all of this yeah. if I want to. If there's an artifact edition, oh, I want it. And like I said, issue the the covered issue two with the the. The cat hauling the bull. Yeah. That is the cover of the series. Yes. That represents this series to a T. Yeah. I want that original piece of art. I want it. Yeah. There's just there's just something wholesome and and like you just want to see all of these people overcome. Yeah, overcome this this ter this yeah, tyrannical this tyrannical government. Yeah. yeah. And it, and what they have to go about to do it. It's like yeah. they know Thrash, they can't fight them. food. They can't fight them at that level. Yeah. So they gotta fight them by other means. Yeah. And this cat, like what she does, it's like yeah. she's got kittens, and like she's yes. willing to put her life on the line. Yeah, with help with the help of Caesar and yeah. the, the knowledgeable rat. It's kind of it's kind of like a, a Gandhi. He's kind of like he's, he's got the glasses like Gandhi. On, yeah, yeah. He just parts. I I love like his dialogue when yeah, he talks about the, the lighter. Yes. Yeah. Oh, the, the light the the lighter is one of the yeah. best parts. Yeah. The I analogy he yes. brings up mm -hmm. and how you can steal it. You, yeah. yeah. Can, I can, you can beg gift for it, it. Or you can gift it. Or, yeah. You yeah. can gift it. Yeah. Or we can become friends, friends later yeah. on and I can give it to you. Yeah. It's like yeah. either way I give it. It's like it eats it. It's still a lighter, but it's, it's, you're going to treat it differently how, yes. when you receive it. And mm -hmm. it's like, holy shit. That's mm -hmm. so true. Yes. I mean, th that's basically what this is. It's like, it's reduced down to that, just a lighter, and it, mm -hmm. it's so well done. Mm -hmm. It's per, it's so great. I just wish you could see this part better. Yeah, you know, right now, my my two series of the year right now are Echo Lands and Animal Castle. Yep, these are the top two right now. It's and if you are not reading either one right now, I hate to say shame on you. <laughs> I don't want to say shame on you. I hate having to say it, but please, do yourself a favor. Read these. Read Echo Lands. Read Animal Castle. You will enjoy these. You will. They are terrific. Yeah. I'll find it hard pressed to anybody. Even it's like art and page layout aside, are argue like why isn't it 
I don't understand how somebody could say, eh, yeah, it's okay. It's been done before. It's like, where has this been done before outside of Animal Farm? Okay, from Watership Down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see rabbits yeah. die. That's fun. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, I just think this is important right now. Mm -hmm. This is huge. Like, this needs to be talked about. Why well, nobody's talking about it? I don't know. Yeah, no one is. I don't. Outside of us. Outside of us. When, I, when I'm with Wes on the weekends, we're talking about yeah. Animal Castle. That's about it. Yeah, I don't know anybody else talking about it. Yeah. It's a shame. Yes, it is. So, pick of the week. Animal Castle. The Trace. Damn good. So, there you go, guys. That's top 10 of the week. What do you think? Are we 100% correct? Is Kyle 1% correct? Let us know in the comments, guys. Uh, so, next week, we're going to have another studio change. <laughs> It's our fifth one. Yeah, I think Studio Location Delta. Yeah. Yeah, Studio Location Delta. Sean's taking us out of his office here. Yep. We're get, we got, so we got kicked out of all the original studios. The one now is a, um, what, it's a what, what not? What's a whatnot studio now? Yep. So, got to make money. Yep. So the, this next location, it's going to be better. Better. Huge. More permanent. Secret. Se yes, it is legit secret. It's very underground. Secret. Man cave. Hush, hush. Very hush hush. Yes, no one's gonna know about it. Hopefully, the lighting's good. Yes, it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, I forgot about that. I forgot about that factor. So yeah, let us know in the comments, guys. Let us know, let us know what you think, and uh, we'll see you guys again next time next week. And meantime, take her easy.